What is it with historical weapons and lanterns? Remember the lantern shield I talked about recently? Now I stumbled upon the lantern pistol, and it's one of the craziest, most astonishingly gimmicky things I've seen. It showed up at an auction house in Sarzana, Italy, and it's supposed to date to about 1800. Apparently it's an upside down flintlock pistol with an iron lantern attached to it, which has a candle inside and a door with a glass lens. Frankly, I don't even know what to say about this device. It looks like something an absinthe addicted steampunk inventor would come up with. Just glue some gears and vacuum tubes on it and it's perfect. Being a flintlock pistol and considering how bulky and awkwardly shaped the thing is, can you imagine how frustrating the loading process might be? So then you get only one shot and you can't even aim. With the barrel upside down, there is no way to even approximate sighting, so you could only vaguely point it. Maybe with shot or buck and ball, there is a chance of accomplishing something at 5 meters or so, but it really seems more like a deterrent than an even halfway effective weapon. The bore is about a 67 caliber, so I suppose the candle needs to be attached pretty firmly. Depending on the powder charge, the recoil could be quite substantial and really strange considering how it would push the barrel downwards rather than up. And you know what? I found another lantern pistol. That one looks a lot more practical. It's a standard flintlock pistol with a side-mounted lantern. But how you're supposed to carry it is beyond me. And that extra weight wouldn't be fun when trying to aim or even just point the pistol. Most importantly, why? Why fix a lantern to a pistol when you could simply hold it in the other hand? Did they want to keep that hand free to hold a sword or a knife or whatever else? <laughs> a cane? A lantern pistol warhammer bayonet sword cane with cigar lighter umbrella perhaps? Oh, and if that's not enough lanterns for you yet, how about this? Yes, those are indeed lantern halberds. 21st century video game designers are clearly not the first ones to come up with bizarre weapon designs. Anyway, maybe you got a chuckle out of this, and thanks for watching.